case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The Massachusetts Supreme Judicial Court heard the case of U.S. Bank National Assen v. Ibanez in 2011. The focus of the case was to determine if a foreclosing entity needed to be the mortgage holder at the time of the notice and foreclosure sale, setting a precedent for future real estate cases. The roots of this case sprouted from two separate instances where banks foreclosed on properties and subsequently repurchased them during foreclosure sales. First, the U.S. Bank National Association, intended to prove its ownership, presented a memo indicating the property would be incorporated into a trust to which they autonomously claimed to be the mortgage holder. Similarly, in the second instance, Wells Fargo Bank strived to establish its ownership without having the actual mortgage agreement in hand. They instead offered an unsigned document as evidence. Both banks implored the court to declare that they were the lawful owners of the properties at the heart of the proceedings. However, the court concluded that the two financial institutions could not solidify their claims of holding the mortgages when the foreclosures occurred. Consequently, their appeals for clear property title were unequivocally rejected. Conclusively, the court declared the foreclosures invalid. This was primarily due to U.S. Bank National Association and Wells Fargo Bank's inability to provide concrete proof of their status as mortgages at the crucial time frame of the notice of sale and actual foreclosure. It was revealed that their respective mortgages had been bundled into a trust and turned into mortgage-backed securities. The court agreed that the hastened moves by the banks had led to them not possessing the authority to sell nor clear title to the properties in question. This ruling underscores the significance of strict compliance with legal procedures in foreclosure circumstances. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.